taking over, doing behind the scenes, some TikToks. We got matcha bars, I got the Mel's maple one and the girls tried it for the first time. Did you like the Mel's maple one? I like the cold one. Sweet. Yeah, yeah they find it a bit sweet. It's very sweet but yeah. it's nice. Um, Mia made me try the blueberry one, I think it's a bit meh. I think you just yeah. need to try the cold version. Yeah. I don't think you like the hot. Oh yeah, you got the hot. But then I just didn't like the undertaste to it. Like, mm -hmm. anyways, Can try the Mel's maple or any. They're all good to be honest. So. Oh, <laughs> Hi guys, it's now the next day. I'll open some packages with you. This guy's still not doing really well to be honest. So we're gonna bring her to the vet later today. So Olaplex have a leave-in conditioner. I don't have much of these. I feel like I, I needed to get some. So this has actually come in perfect timing because I don't really wear conditioner in the shower. Although I did try the Fenty hair conditioner or hair mask. Guys, not only does the does it smell so good like my hair felt really nice after and it smells amazing the Fenty hair range and I believe they're going to make it an actual scent so yeah this is the new leave-in conditioner can't wait to try this orange package I feel like this will be something for Diwali maybe say perishable in here and I just left this for a couple days I think it's been a few days now Sure. I forgot that I didn't open this earlier, but I've just been so preoccupied with everything with Sky, like, and just work. I've just. <sighs> Energy is not even there, guys. I didn't even open this. Oh my god, there was some food in here. This is from Elf. It says, Happy Diwali. Wishing you a bright and joyful day. Please enjoy these lovely Elf essentials, hawas, and laddus. They've been so. Oh, this looks bomb. Uh, thank you, Elle. This is like the sweetest thing. I think the Laddu's a bit R.I.P. <laughs> the Laddu's... I don't know if I can still eat this, but they've kind of like broken, unfortunately. I think this was during like transit. Do you know what? I've been wanting to try more Elf stuff, so like maybe we should do an Elf testing out video. They have uh, this oil kit. This is such a cute like stocking filler or like a gift by the way for like Christmas time. But they ha I haven't tried this one. It's like a sparkly shade. Stay on night microfine setting mist. Mascara. I love these liquid eyeshadows. I don't think I have this shade though. And they gave me a couple actually. This holographic one. Eyeshadow. I have these already. Camo liquid blushes. Love these. And another eyeshadow. So thank you so much to Elle for sending that. I love that those. Especially when I like bright orange like this and there's no nuts in them oh my god i just ate a piece of cardamom and they're still edible i probably have to eat it with a spoon they're just broken down basically anyways i'm gonna make my cup of tea i've been wanting one since i woke up <laughs> honestly when i was speaking to you guys yesterday when i was showing you the um, the pr packages i honestly did not think i was kind of you know allowing the idea you know to seep in that maybe we it might be time to let her go because she was just getting worse and worse but sky was not getting better but the day before yesterday she was showing some signs of like moving around and being interested in her food like she had like three treat tubes i honestly did not think when i went to the fair yesterday we would have to say goodbye to her unfortunately she was showing signs of kidney failure her heart had a murmur as well she hadn't eaten she was getting weak and she honestly she was just skin and bones she her health just literally went downhill I know a lot of you love seeing sky um in the vlogs and a lot of you probably attached to her as well it's kind of i was thinking you know when i watch it's judy's life and when she lost her mum, i don't know like i just felt so much sadness because and I cried because I watched them literally every day. So you kind of form some sort of attachment to these people you, you watch online. And I know a lot of you were attached to Little Sky and you love seeing her in the vlogs. So, and I shared all my life online. So I, I felt like, I feel like I, I, you know, I want to share the news with you. And it helps to talk about it because I'm such an emotional person it does help to talk about it and accepted that it was the best thing to do like she's not suffering but it's not the first time where I've, we've had to say goodbye to one of our pets i mean our childhood dog was like the hardest thing ever you think i thought maybe this time it would be a bit easier but it never is 
don't think it gets easier. I think with time you heal from the loss, but actually saying goodbye it never gets easier. I always say that, you know, animals have a much shorter lifespan than us and we're just here to make, you know, their lives a bit, you know, that bit better whilst they're here on this earth. I was looking at all like her old videos and photos. I think what was hard was coming home from the vet with her empty carrier bag. Coming home to see her stuff on the floor. And even today, like, when I wake up, one of the first things I do is, like, sit here with her. I did share the news on my Instagram, and honestly, the love that you guys gave, honestly, it has helped. Like, just reading your comments. I'm sorry for, like, those who are also going through the same thing, and who have been affected by this, because a lot of you love, love Sky. I mean, I've been showing her on her blogs for years, guys. But if I look at her, this has been going on for a month, and I, I think it's slowly been eating at me from the inside. Just seeing her go not eat like my mind has been preoccupied like even at work i haven't been good going on for a month and i tried everything we even tried the surgery hoping the surgery would help but it didn't she did have a condition in her teeth but unfortunately because of the other issues that's like coming out which i think was worsened by the the operation it was her time and she was old it just sucks it just sucks i feel like yesterday i, I did nothing like i just Went for a late night drive, I binge watch some Nobody Wants This because if I just sit there not doing anything, guys, I did she will spiral into like some sort of sad, deep sadness. I think in a couple of days I'll feel like, I'll still feel like this empty, like right now I feel a void, like I feel like a chunk of me has been taken away from me and it's like that gut feeling, like that emptiness you feel. I think that will kind of suppress and I think in a few days like I, I won't be crying so easily because even when I went out with the girls they wanted they were telling me you know we can cancel and stuff but we had arranged it so long ago and I feel like because this has been going for, for on for a month I felt like I needed to maybe just spend some time with the girls and get out a bit you know do something I had a few laughs and kind of let go a bit and it was nice talking to them I even like it was hard talking because like, I even cried up in the restaurant which is so embarrassing um, I'd literally cry at anything I have so many photos and videos I'm, this is one thing I love from the fact that we take so many videos and photos is that I've got endless I've got endless memories of her through the vlogs through the videos the photos that me and my family have taken okay I'm gonna go I'm gonna go now I'm just walking around to be honest guys it's really like helping me this is like the chocolate haul it's like unlimited chocolate yeah, this whole box is 24 which isn't too bad actually Those chocolate like pieces were two pound fifty each. Oh my god! Hey, do you know where I can find the honey cake? It's like the food section. Mm. Can get like hummus, moussaka. You can get these rolls. That one's wrapped in fruit and veg. I think I found it. It's there. I can see it. Oh my god! So this is the honey cake, I've been like dying to try this and I might get a red velvet one as well. Pumpkin pie, a legit pumpkin pie. Apparently the honey cake is going to be really good but I might get a pumpkin pie because I've never actually tried actual pumpkin pie. We've had it in a drink so yeah, I'm going to get that, I'm going to get a few pieces and just keep my face off and it'll make me feel better. We were just walking around in Harrods been nice but it's actually like way busier than I thought because it's like a mid it's like midweek in the middle of the day like these must be tourists like snowman cakes like pineapple passion fruit Christmas red bubble raspberry and vanilla
so it's now been it's been two weeks now since sky i can't i can't explain how hard it is when you lose a pet because and especially maybe for me it's heightened because i'm very i'm a very emotional person it's hard because when you come home and like everything i look at like i think about it sucks but it is life and you know it's just it's just how it is and i look back now and i do feel better obviously and it's been helping to like keep busy and like luckily like i love content creating so that has really helped me honestly i feel like that has really what's helped me my content creation because it's something that i love and it's something that you know is therapy for me and also working out working out has really helped me too and just talking about it when i look back now like i i really she was really unwell i tried everything and if anything like i there's no point in regretting but like I, I did what i could and i did what i was advised to do i'm just so sad that she had to go through this major surgery for it not to be the main issue that was causing her i don't know pain or just made her completely lose appetite she just went through a major surgery for it for her to just like wither away like that and it's crazy how fast they deteriorate because even with our pet lily you guys would have probably seen her in my old old vlogs we had her for 14 years and she deteriorated in two days so it happens very quickly with sky it took a bit longer and i tried absolutely everything but when i think about like her last few weeks she was just so unwell i know today i made the right decision and it's what had to be done and it sucks I'm so 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 happy that I vlog because I have so many videos to look back on especially the last one where like we see more of her and she was a bit more well like she wasn't as bad as the last few days feeling slowly more myself and I don't feel like that pit empty feeling anymore I tell myself she's not suffering anymore so yeah I still have my moments today and I've had my time to cry all out and really feel the feelings but for me I I think what's really helped is keeping me busy, keeping my workouts because I don't want to fall in this pit of depression because of all of this. And honestly, thank you for all of your messages. Anyways, I'm going to leave you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.